Hello Sagittarius, thank you so much for tuning in. This is going to be your money and career reading. If this uh, reading resonates with you, please be sure to click on the like button below and also click on the red subscribe button on the bottom left hand side underneath the video so that any future uh, posts that I put up on YouTube will automatically show up on your YouTube feed. If the video does not resonate with you, please keep in mind this is a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone and to also check your moon and rising signs. So let's go ahead and get started. We have some messages for Sagittarius. Sagittarius. So the underlining energy of the reading is the King of Cups. The King of Cups, Sagittarius. Okay. So what that tells me is, is that um, you may be going into, uh, I feel like you're going to be going into a partnership with somebody. Okay. And uh, this person, uh, being that it is a king, this is going to be maybe perhaps your employer. Okay. This is someone who is very well off, someone who's been in business a long time. Um, and they're going to, you know, they might offer you or you may ask to go into business with them. This is going to be a long term commitment because, you know, Cups is Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. This is like long term. Okay. I mean, if this was a love reading, I would call this the, the hubby or the father, um, you know, type of guy. Okay. So this is someone that is like, long term uh, when he makes a commitment it's long term or when she makes a commitment it's long term so this is going to be a partnership coming into play now here we have the hanged man that is your that's where you're at right now so right now you're just kind of waiting you're not sure what's going to happen um you're just waiting and what's crossing you is the fool the risks the new beginnings, the making the decision. So you're waiting because you're afraid to take the risk. You're afraid to take the jump, Sagittarius. Now, the best that can happen if you do take the jump is a new path in career, new beginnings in your career. That's the best that can happen, all right? Now, the reason why you're tuning into this reading is because you're scared, Sagittarius. You're scared. You have a lot of sleepless nights. You don't know if you should take this risk. Should I go into partner? The, you know, should I go into business with this person or not? Is it going to work out for me? Um, you're tuning into this channel right now because you have fear. In the recent past, you were betrayed, Sagittarius. The Ten of Swords, you were betrayed. You were really hurt in the past. Uh, by somebody that you were in business with. Um, but the good news is, is that the Ten of Swords also brings with it um, blessings. It's something that had to happen so that something new can begin and, and that newness is great, okay? Now, in the recent future, we have the Hierophant, which again is unity, marriage. If this was a love reading, it would be unity and marriage, being that this is a financial reading. I feel like whatever you, whatever partnership you're going to get into, this is going to be long lasting and it's blessed. This is the priest of the deck. This is a blessing. This is something that you have, you know, manifested and it's, this is something that you have used your intuition on. Okay. So you're going to use your intuition and this is going to be a long standing business partnership. All right. Now here we have your current state of mind is the queen of swords, which obviously makes sense because look at you here. Okay. You're very guarded. You're very guarded. And I think, you know, from what I, from the, the energy that I'm feeling here is that you're going into business with the person that did this to you. You're going into a business with a past employer or somebody that hurt you badly like this. And this is why you really have this massive fear and this indecision. This is why you're waiting. This is why you're just kind of hanging around waiting. Very unsure if you should take the risk, Sagittarius. You're very unsure if you should make this deep commitment. Uh, with this with this person because they hurt you in the best and you still have your guard up you're using your mind here you're trying to think if this is going to be beneficial for you your current environment is the six of wands victory okay you're being praised um this this past situation here whoever hurts you is now praising you 
they are praising you, Sagittarius. Uh, you, you gained victory. Like I said, something had to had to die, had to, you know, you got stamped in the back, but something beautiful came out of it, and this is the beauty right here. Victory, okay? What is your biggest hope and your worst fear? The truth coming to light. You're, you're, you finding out a painful truth, you getting heartbroken again by this person, okay? Your biggest fear is that this happens, and that, in, in a way, your biggest hope is that this happens again so that you could just walk away from all this turmoil and waiting and stress that you're dealing with. You're kind of wishing that he would just kind of, you know, screw you over so that you could walk away and say, okay, I'm done, I knew this was gonna happen, end of discussion. I don't have to worry about this anymore, okay? so. That's your biggest hope and that's your biggest fear, okay? But I don't, you know, I'm not seeing that this person is out to hurt you again. I mean, he's pretty victorious. I mean, he's praising you right now. He or she is praising you right now. Um, the outcome of this, <laughs> I love this card, the Nine of Pentacles. This partnership is going to make you, you're good. Look at all this money. I don't even have to say anything. Just look at all this money. There's just money falling everywhere. Financial stability and independence, Sagittarius. Okay. So here I see a bad situation in the past. You're really worried if you, I feel like this part, part person, because we have two partnership cards here. Okay. So, and these aren't just dalliances. This is going to be a long standing business partnership okay it's going to be with somebody that you had a falling out with in the past this is causing you a lot of anxiety it's causing you to hold back it's causing you to be afraid to take new risks the best case scenario is new beginnings in career they're praising you right now you still have your guard up you're worried about you know something coming to light that's going to hurt you but in the end Sagittarius you're going to be on top of the world on top of the world so I hope you enjoyed your reading. Please be sure to like. And again, the uh, subscription button is on the bottom left hand underneath the video. Tap on that one so that this way any future uh, videos that I post will come up on your feed. Good luck to you, Sagittarius. Have a great day.